2062. A dark megalopolis run by corporations and corrupt politicians. Nine-year-old orphan Tina has made the streets her home. She scavenges for a living, reinventing uses for scraps. Her only friend is SAM-53, the big clumsy robot assigned to her at birth. He will do anything to protect her. SAM-53 must protect Tina. One day, Tina and Sam will discover something that may change their world. This is the night before that day. The beginning to an incredible journey. The journey to... Yes, team. 11.34 kilometers away. We must take another fly bus to reach our place. Damn. We should find a ticket. It's getting late and very cold out here. You must return to our shelter as soon as possible. Okay, okay. Let's look around. All right. Let's go. I don't have any credits. You give it credits, and it gives you flybus tickets. Sure, talking to a ticket machine. Come on. We don't have any credits. It's a Neo Berlin Flybus ticket machine. The screen says, please insert credits. Hello there. Hey, Beefcake. What's up? Nothing really. I'd better go. All right. Have fun with that stinky human. And come back when you have money. I don't want to throw anything away. Hey, there's a rusty cybercola can in here. Seems like no one is really using it. Howdy, pal. How are you? Do we know each other? Am I your cousin? Um, no. So leave me alone! And keep your disgusting human away from me! You truly are a nasty robot. Say what? Do you have any free fly bus tickets? Do I look like a ticket machine? Um, no. But maybe... No, I don't got no free ticket. Now leave me alone. What are you doing there? You mean besides making fun of clumsy family robots? Yes. Well, I can't go nowhere. My damn ram is faulty and I need a daggum new one. So I can go back to my street cleaning job. Then why don't you go get one? Because I'm stuck here. Without enough RAM, I can't calculate how to move around this dirty city. I have barely enough capacity to insult fat nanny robots. 
So if I give you new RAM, you can help me? Oh, fine. Something interested from your mouth. If it doesn't involve changing diapers of stinky humans, I can help. Very good. I'll come back when I have some spare RAM. All right. See you later, Mr. Never Skip Legs Day. Good evening, officer. Good evening, Model SAM-53. How can I help you? Do you have any spare credits? I need to take this little human home. Uh, the salary sucks. I can barely get enough to pay my charging boot. And if I wasn't busy handling this terrible traffic, I could search for Roscoe Spencer and get the 10,000 credits reward. Roscoe Spencer? Yes, a criminal that publicly offended the mayor of Neo Berlin. He is wanted, but the police doesn't have enough information. Just that he loves Asian food and he has long mustaches. Interesting. 10,000 credits reward? Mm-hmm. To whomever provides a clue to his identity. Like what? Like a fingerprint that we could use to scan New Berlin police archives. Okay. Memorize that. I'd better go looking for Roscoe. Good luck, and come back when you have evidence. It says, ramen shop, quick delivery. Hi there. Buzz off, Tin Man. You despicable example of the most vulgar capitalism. Stealing jobs from humans. No space anymore for the working class. Uh, okay. I guess he doesn't like robots. Better if Tina talks with him. Hello? What's up, kid? I hope you have a good reason to interrupt my delicious meal. How's the food in here? Oh, I love it. Much better than the chow at the factory canteen. I have to talk with the union. We should strike again. This time for two weeks. Damn those corporations. They don't care about work conditions for humans. Yeah, I hate those big corks. Go ahead. You have all my support. Thank you, kid. We need it. <laughs> Anything else? Do you have any spare bus tickets? Spare bus tickets? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Since that swine of a mayor raised the transportation fee, I'm forced to go around on my grandpa's bike. I don't like Mr. Rumpf. His chubby, nasty face is all around the city. Yes, hoping to get re-elected. <laughs> That pig will never get my vote. Neither mine. I guess you're too young to vote. <laughs> but I like your attitude. <laughs> Anything else? Nice mustaches. Is it difficult to grow them like that? It's not, but it takes a lot of care. Are you planning to grow a pair, little boy? I'm not a boy. I'm a girl. What? Really? Uh, sorry. Thought you were a boy. Eh, uh, no. I'm a child of this dark city. I've lived alone for the last three years. Just me and my robot, scavenging the dirty corners of this megalopolis. Wow, that's incredible! Who wrote you this character background? Uh, I don't know. But, okay, fair enough. That explains a lot, my tough tomboy. <laughs> Anything else? Are you Roscoe Spencer, the criminal? <laughs> Be quiet. Neo Berlin police have ears in every corner. <clears throat> but, but no, I've never heard of any Roscoe Spencer. Are you sure? You look like him. What? Have they already put around my wanted photo? I, I thought they needed evidence first. I was sure they only had that outrageous internet post about Rumpf. 
Oh, that sleazy capitalist swine. Hope to see him sink in the mud. Uh, but, 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 but no, sorry. I never heard of Roscoe Spencer. So you just said... No, I'm not him. End of story. Uh, anything else? Nothing. I'll leave you alone. Long live Chairman Mao. He looks a bit creepy, but funny at the same time. Don't ask me what it is. Looks dark and sticky. Disgusting! I can't take it with my bare hands. This can's too crumbled to hold any liquid. I need to find something better. A bright Asian lantern. I have a feeling it could be useful. It's selling Japanese food with a German touch. Probably the owner and chef of this place. He looks busy cutting fish. Excuse me? What do you want, little guy? Don't you see I'm a busy? Can I have that paper lamp? Oh no, I like it so much. It gives this place a stereotypical Asian look. Are you sure? I really need it. I'm pretty sure I like it where it is. Isn't there something I can bring you that has more value than that lamp? Something valuable? Hmm. Yeah, like a rusty can of Cybercola or a broken music player. I don't need any of that. But actually, there's something. I really miss my son, Joe. He hasn't visited me in ages. He spends all his time connected to cyberspace and forgets about me. That's sad. If I had a father, I'd spend all my time with him. Sweet girl. But uh, yes, if you could talk to Joe and bring me something to prove his love, I will give you that shoddy paper lamp. Awesome. Where can I find him? He used to hang around the bus stop, tripping all the time. All right. Well, I'll go talk to Joe and bring something that proves his love. Let's see if you can make it. Great. I better go. Gambate, little girl. Something wrong with his headset. Hello. Hey there. Nice helmet you have. What can I do for you? Are you Joe, the son of Heyao? Why are you asking? I was at Heyao's and he told me that his son is often around here. All right, all right. Yes, I'm Joe. What does my father want? Well, he's really worried about you, and he misses you so much. That crazy cook. I miss him too, but I can't stand his mad ideas. He wants me to learn how to cook those German-Japanese dishes, but I'm not into that at all. 
That's why I don't go visit him often. I prefer cyber tripping. It's super cool. Have you tried it? Cyberspace can be very dangerous. I prefer to avoid it. Your choice. But I think you should visit Hayao more often. By the way, do you have something I could bring him to prove your love? Something? What for? It'll make him very happy. And I truly need that Asian lamp. Asian lamp? Never mind. So do you have something I can give him? Hmm. I have a lovely photo of us together that I always carry with me. Great. That'll be perfect. But I'll give it to you only if you do me a favor. Uh, here we go again. What favor? Can you bring me a VR headset screen replacement? I have no money. How can I get one? The electronic shop owner loves robot components. Maybe your mechanic friend can help. Good. I'll ask Sam to deal with it. Awesome. Come back when you have a VR screen replacement, and I'll give you the photo. All right. See you soon. A nerdy guy. I like his sweater, though. It reminds me of something. Excuse me. What can I do for you, robot model SAM? Year of emission 2053, category C, pattern 18. Need a quantum cooling system? Cleaning your Amos eye sensors? I'm Dick Bates, and I'm here to help you. Do you have a spare headset screen to give me? What kind? CRT Model A? 8K dual light? 270 head surround? Well, considering Joe's headset, I guess it's a CRT Slim W. Perfect. I've got a couple in my store. They cost 700 credits. Hmm. Can you give it to me for something else than money? <laughs> like what, potatoes? Something you really, really need, and that I can help find for you? Mm-hmm. There's something that is out of stock in all shops in Neo Berlin. A very rare capacitor, P3OC. There may be some in a bot dispenser not far from here. Unfortunately, that dispenser is only for street cleaner robots. Not your kind. But if I bring you the capacitor, you'll give me the headset screen replacement, right? Yes, I will. I truly need that capacitor for, well, reasons. Okay, then. We'd better go and find a way to get it. See you later. And let me know if you need a new control bus or ROM implants. Obsolete gaming and coding devices. An old Amica 500. Awesome machine. Random access memory. All right. I've got a bunch of these. You could take one. Howdy, pal. How are you? Well, Daga, why are you bothering me, clumsy nanny robot? We are monitoring you for 
regarding the ram. Yes? Have you found one? Yes. Here it is. Oh, well, should I say thank you? Because I won't. But I guess I owe you one. What can I do for you? I need a P30-C capacitor from the bot dispenser. But that machine is only for street cleaner robots. Can you help me get one? Mm, God, it is so nice staying here doing nothing. But all right, follow me. I don't want to ruin my reputation because of some chubby family bot. Thank you. We're even now. Hope you won't bother me again. Goodbye. Ready after you've given all your savings to the game developer. I'm part of the same incentive but an older robot generation. A VR headset shop closed. An old woman with some cyber implants and a walking cane. Excuse me. Hello, Model S.A.M. Nice robot you are, uh, aren't you? But my powers do not work with robots. So I'd better talk with your master. All right. I'll tell Tina. Have a nice journey. I feel that you and that little girl will have lots of amazing adventures. Hello, old lady. Hello, cute little girl. How can I help you? What are you doing out here? I'm the Fate Mancer. I can tell the future by scanning someone's brain. But business lately is very bad. Nobody cares about the future anymore. They just spend hours connected to cyberspace and forget life. That sucks. And you? Would you like to know your future? Of course, but I don't have any cash. Don't worry, I like you. I can tell your future for free. What would you like to know? Nothing specific. I'm just curious to know what lies ahead. Let me see. Wow. Amazing. Incredible. Hey, move on. I don't have all night. Okay, impatient girl. I see. I see an incredible adventure. Something beyond the realms of human consciousness. An important mission. A task that can forever change the world we live in. A journey through places where no one living has been before. Oh, and you, my little girl, could be the key for a human awakening, for a brand new world. Amazing. But first, you need to find a ticket to get home. And the developer needs to get enough funds through Kickstarter. What? Uh, forget about that last part. But yes, something incredible lies ahead. Cool. Here, take this flight. There's also my number. Call me if you need anything.
Thank you, old lady. I will. And don't forget to tell all your friends to back the Kickstarter. Um, okay. Goodbye. Bye for now. Excuse me. What can I do for you, robot model SAM? Year of emission 2053, category C, pattern 18. Need a quantum cooling system? Cleaning your Amos eye sensors? I'm Dick Bates, and I'm here to help you. About the capacitor. Yes? I found one. Ah. Oh. Perfect. Exactly what I needed for, uh, um, can't tell you. You are welcome. Can I have the VR screen replacement now? Of course. Here it is. I'm not sure what you need it for, but you are welcome. Thanks a lot. I'd better go now. See you around. And come back if you need a BU Kowski optical drive. you have. What can I do for you? About the VR screen replacement. Have you got one? Not really. Where did you say we can get one? Ask at the electronic shop not far from here. All right. I'll go and ask. Awesome. See you later. Hello. Hey, big bot. What's up? About the VR screen replacement. Have you got one? Yes, we have. That's dope. Thank you very much. No problem. Here, take this photo of me and my dad. I'm sure it'll make him cry. Perfect. We'll go give it to him. See you later, Big Bot. I'll go back to tripping. Hopefully those hot chicks are still there. Goodbye. Thanks. Little guy, don't you see I'm a busy? Regarding your son, yes, I talked with him and he gave me this. Oh, thank you very much. He loves me, then. I'm so happy. I should go talk to him. Together, we can be the best ships of Neoparin. He surely loves you, but I'm not sure he'd like to learn your recipes. Anyway, can I get that lamp now? Yes, now you can. Thanks a lot for your help. You are welcome. And come back if you want some of my delicious dishes. Sure thing. <laughs> Sayonara, little girl. can't reach it, but Sam probably can.
Thanks. It doesn't work. My robotic eyes detect a credit card down there. There's something there, but my hands are too big for the grid. I can't do that. I'd be tampering with public property. shining down there, but I can't reach it. Ugh. I'm too weak to pull it over. It's selling some kind of weird device called Vintage Me. I don't have any credits. I'm not strong enough. Let me see if I can do something. Hey, something fell down. Nice. Everything looks like a game from the early 90s now. Thank you, but I don't need it. The mayor of Neo Berlin, looking for his third mandate. A vending machine selling rocket soda. A lamp securely mounted on the wall. Pointless thing to do. I'm not programmed to damage public property. It's so dark that even my advanced eyes can't see. However, I can barely notice something. We need some sort of light to see better. I'm sure in the future, cyber octopuses will be a thing. effort for a piece of rope. I hope it's worth it. Nah.
Let me see. Hooray! I got that disgusting thing, but what for? Let's try this. Got a sticky paper now. Excuse me? Yes. Regarding that criminal Rasko. Yes. Have you found any proof to identify him? I think so. Is this okay? It should be enough. Thanks. Can I have my reward now? Sure. Please insert the credit card in the slot below my badge. And I'll transfer the reward. I don't have a credit card. Then I'm afraid I can't pay you the reward. Come back when you have one. Oh, Lord of all the robots. Okay, okay. I'll go looking for a credit card. Can't do that. Thanks. Let me tie those up. Got a rod and a line now, but it's still missing something. Not working. It doesn't work. Yummy. Lady. Hello, cute little girl. How can I help you? Nothing. I better go. Goodbye, little girl. Let me tie those up. Great. I've got a fishing tool now. Let's see if it works. Excuse me? Yes. About the reward. Have you got a credit card so I can transfer you the money? I think so. 
Is this okay? It should be. Here, take your 883 new Berlin credits. 883? Wasn't the reward 10,000 Neo Berlin credits? Yes, but looking at your records, 10,000 minus, 2,500 for being alone at night, 3,000 for scavenging from downstairs, 1,500 for exploitation of robots, 1,000 for talking with strangers, and 1,117 for picking up unauthorized objects. Total transfer, 883 credits. Blimey! All this effort for 883 credits? At least there should be enough to buy many flybus tickets. I better go home. Be good and follow the law. Please select your ticket. Thank you. Have a nice journey. It's time to go home. It's the flybus timetable. Looks like time was frozen in Neo Berlin. The flybus routes. I need to take number 12 to get to my shelter. Let's go home. Sweet home. We finally made it. I think you should sleep now. You've been awake for 18 hours and 43 minutes. All right, all right. I feel exhausted. But first, let me say something to the people out there. This long night is over, as well as the demo of Encodia. Congratulations for completing it. Tomorrow, an amazing adventure awaits. But the developer needs your help to finish the game. So, if you enjoyed this demo and you would like to play more, please consider a PayPal donation or a Kickstarter contribution. Just Google Encodia and you'll find all of our pages. We truly count on you. Spread the word about Encodia out there. And see you soon. Maybe. What? Well, taking into consideration the average Kickstarter donation, the fact that users enjoy playing a free demo but not spending money, and adding as a factor that it's an indie game in a narrow subgenre setting, I estimate there's a 67% chance of success. Not to mention, this is...